I think the basic challenges is for constituting Bangladesh into a viable state. Okay, when I say the viable state, it can it can it can see it from the liberal perspective as well, saying that you are going to constitute a Bangladesh into a democratic state. So you need a democratic constitution. So that's a, a major challenge. And secondly, also to resolve some of the um, the, the contradictions and antagonism at the political level and the cultural level. Uh, often people see this as an identity crisis. They say that political problem is a problem of identity crisis. It's really methodologically, I disagree with them. Mm -hmm. Because you have to, uh, if you look into the Bangladesh history as how the, let's say, Muslim subjectivity has been historically constituted and how the Bengali subjectivity has been constituted and what are the contradictions. And can you read, understand these contradictions in the context of the colonial history, so that means there is a quite long colonial history, and um, if you if you do not bring the colonial context, you don't understand why, for example, the Muslims of that part of the world uh, demanded Pakistan in 1947, and why they felt it was necessary for them, and secondly, why again in 1952. Uh, we, we also saw a Bengali subjectivity appearing, claiming themselves to be in a Bengali is their only identity and articulating their identity in the ideology of Bengal nationalisms. Mm -hmm. So these are very, very interesting in a certain sense. Uh, at the same time, once you understand these, these things historically, it is very easy also to resolve it. Mm -hmm.